April 19th, 2016. Look to me. My little ones, the night is thick with evil. Stay close to me, for I am your only safeguard. World leaders have met with the ruler of darkness and have aligned their total allegiance with him. This does not bode well for the bulk of humanity, for they have mocked me, trodden my grace underfoot, and counted my love as a thing of naught. The winepress of earth's judgment has been filled. My fury will soon be poured out in a manner the world has never known, bowl upon bowl and vial upon vial. Relentless are the judgments sentenced upon the earth, and many will die from sheer fear alone. Your once great nation will be rocked to the core and then disintegrate, for there will be no organized military, first responders, or police defense equipped to touch even the smallest of these great areas of need. Bridges will be down, communication systems will be dissolved, and basic supplies will be an extreme scarcity. My bride, it is during this time that you will be transformed. You will be clothed in my righteousness and shine as stars in the blackest of night. You will be equipped by my power, and I will send you straight into the darkness. Do not fear, but rather rejoice as you see this day approaching. Multitudes will come to me renouncing their sins. For earth's harvest is ripe, and heaven has prepared to receive them. Many, many are the souls who do not know me today, and yet their mansions are prepared, and their families await them. Multitudes of aborted children from earth have been busy about my father's business. They are now grown and have built and lavishly decorated mansions for their lost families on earth. They have completed their tasks and now wait by the door to welcome their mothers, fathers, sisters, and brothers home. As these children have feverishly worked, they have prayed for their loved, their lost loved ones on earth, and I say unto you, they have not prayed in vain. Everything possible has been done to awaken these lost ones, along with multitudes of others, and ripen them for the harvest. I will send you, my bride, to lead them to the cross and bring them home. Joy, as you have never dreamed possible, accompanies your tasks in the days ahead. Keep your eyes on me, my little ones, and be not encumbered by the cares of this world, for I will come as a thief in the night. Put all of your faith and trust in me alone, for just ahead lies earth's darkest hour, and you will again find I am all you need. Shalom.